What's going on guys, my name is Connor, and today I'm going to be for you guys on the Louis Vuitton watercolor skateboard. If you guys are into this kind of content, make sure to leave a like and subscribe, as I do consistently post the craziest hype and design items on YouTube. And while you're at it, make sure to claim your four free socks on Weeble by clicking the link below. All you gotta do is sign up, you get two socks for free, you get another two after your first deposit. And lastly, before I get into the video, if you guys are looking to buy or sell any high-end designer or hype items, make sure to reach out to me on Instagram, at Connor.Langley, as I am always buying and I'm always trying to help you guys out as much as I can. But with that said, let's get right into the review. Alright guys, so just before I open up the box and show you guys the skateboard, I want to go over a few details. First off, the item number of this board is going to be G10622 and it's completely sold out online and in stores. Unless you're a VIC client, they might be able to sneak you a piece. But the retail cost of this is going to be $2,660 USD um, and the market is somewhere around $4,000. So obviously it's a sought after piece that people are happy to pay a lot of money for and you guys can tell that it is extremely limited as the market value has nearly doubled the retail cost but obviously we have a box right here that probably wouldn't fit much other than a skateboard it's a perfect skateboard shape as you guys can see it'll just say Louis Vuitton on the top right there the front part still gonna be magnetic just like most of the other boxes you guys will have this paper right here if you guys look closely the board will be right under it but just before I show you guys that I'll show you guys a little booklet that it comes with and also before I forget I know I'm usually filming videos on my desk but obviously this is a pretty huge item so I wasn't able to fit it on there but here's what it's gonna it's just gonna say Louis Vuitton on right here it's skateboard because that's obviously the item and a lot of this is not going to be in English but for those of you guys who want to pause on a page or just check it out you guys are obviously welcome to do so but I'll just set that to the side really quickly and show you guys what you guys came to see so here's what it looks like here's what the bottom looks like obviously it is very beautiful it's going to be a multi-color it pretty much has every single color in the rainbow on it um, and just before I get into more details I'll show you guys what the other side looks like as well it's just going to be white as you guys can see with some hints of the watercolor throughout the corners especially and then in the center we're going to have the LV symbol right there but setting it down really quickly, just so I could give, go over the measurements really quickly, it is the size of a normal skateboard. So it's gonna be about 31 and a half inches in length, which I believe is regular. For those of you guys who are skateboarders, please correct me if I'm wrong, and also let me know if you guys would ride this thing. But 31 and a half inches in length, and then it's gonna be about eight and a half inches in width. And as far as thickness, it said that it was about four inches. So when it said thickness, I, I am assuming from the bottom of the wheels to the board right here, it's gonna be about four inches in height right there. But the materials used are gonna be wood, obviously, aluminum, and polymer, which I believe the hardware right here is going to be aluminum, and I don't know what would be polymer, or maybe the wheels. I'm not the biggest skateboarder, I apologize. If you guys do look closely, there will be a lot of small details, such as the flowers on the screws right there. You guys can see that the, that the edges will just be strictly wood. They didn't go all around. And you guys will also see that the monogram will fade somewhat. So you guys can see, obviously, it's solid right here, but some parts will be faded. And the watercolor is, like I said, it's going to be close to pretty much every single color in the rainbow right here. You guys can see the wheels. And also, a little detail that a lot of people don't know is all of the centers of the bearings right here are going to be a different color. So you guys can see yellow right here. You can see that this looks like a red. On the other side, we're gonna have a blue. And then on this side, it looks like a pinkish color. So every single color, and I love that detail. And also, if you guys look closely right here, I'm not completely sure what this part of the skateboard is called. I apologize, guys. I know some of you guys who are big skateboarders probably hate me for that. It's gonna have the Louis Vuitton symbol right there. And from what I've heard, the pieces that they use to make this board are actually pretty high quality. Um, I saw someone else reviewing the skateboard that was actually a skateboarder and he seemed to be quite impressed. So if you guys are skateboarders, please let me know down in the comments, did they use good bearings? I don't know what this piece is called. Did they use good wood? What do you guys think of the length of it? Um, I'm probably embarrassing myself for how much, how little I know about skateboards, but this is a collector's piece and most people that are buying these pieces from Louis Vuitton most likely are not actually going to ride them as this is something that would be awesome to put on a wall um, just to have the store in the box just to show people. I know the few people that have came over to my house and that I've shown um, this board, they've been quite impressed and 
it, it's something that you don't really see. Um, some might assume that it's fake because it's like, what, a Louis Vuitton skateboard? When you think of Louis Vuitton, you obviously think of bags and maybe clothing. But a skateboard, that seems a little bit unnecessary. And obviously the skateboards that I've seen have been usually somewhere around a couple hundred dollars per solid skateboard. But some people are paying close to four, five, six, even I've seen these sell up to $6,000 for this one skateboard that they're not even gonna ride that they're just gonna have. So it's definitely an art piece in my opinion. Let me know what you guys think. But just before I close out the video, if you guys are at this point and still watching, make sure to leave a like and subscribe as it is not easy to get these items in hand. And also let me know what else you guys wanna see on my channel. Are there any other items from this collection that you guys wanna see? Are there any other items period that you guys wanna see? I know I've reviewed a lot of crazy items, but I really do have access to almost anything if you guys saw that jacket that floyd mayweather wore to the super bowl it's called the admiral louis vuitton jacket and it was extremely limited retail was up there around six thousand but they sold out so now they're going closer to ten to twelve thousand i was able to get that in hand so that just goes to show that i can get almost anything um but yeah if you guys are also looking to sell i do pay well as i do have a lot of high-end clients that are willing to pay me so i can just kind of be the middleman and help you guys out if i can but let me know what you guys think of the skateboard do you guys think that it's overpriced would you guys pay the retail cost for this board if you guys had the option to would you guys pay the market value possibly let me know what you guys think i know a lot of people have a lot of different opinions when they're spending when a skateboard costs about four thousand dollars market and about $2,600 retail so there's a lot in the air there and I know a lot of people are gonna have a lot of different opinions so let me know I'm genuinely curious make sure to leave it down in the comments so I can answer any questions for everyone but with that said make sure to hit the like and subscribe button if you guys enjoyed the video um, and I will see you guys in the next one